points, and then it's Albina Longanova and Afsane Shafi tied up in seventh place with 15 points. Three other archers are in ninth place with 13 points. So those are the standings as we get set for the individual competition right now. This is the women's bronze medal match, and this is Yashim Bostan of Turkey. And the hometown crowd goes wild. And I've got to imagine that's thrilling and also pressure packed all at the same time for Yashim Bostan. Yeah, I think, you know, she's a young archer that both are in this match. And uh, this is going to be a new experience for her, really. But uh, as I say, the youngsters normally take it in their stride. Yashim Bostan, 19 years old, ranked 203rd in the world, and she will be taking on Janine Meissner of Germany. Janine defeated Albina Loganova by five, dropped a three-point decision, though, to Fatima Almashadani, whom we'll see momentarily. And she winds up in the bronze medal match. There's a good look at Janine Meissner, also 19 years old. Joined the national team last year. And this past week, as we said, defeated Albina before losing to Almashadani. As for Yashim Bostan, she was two better than Linda Ochoa of Mexico before falling by five to Russia's Natalia Avdiva. So two young 19-year-olds in this bronze medal match. Meissner on target number one. Yashim Bostan on target number two. Two young archers, but this is the second time these pair have met. So they already shot against each other in the European Youth Championships earlier this year in Sylvania. And the scores were? Well, Boston won. So 144 to 139. It's a five point deficit there, so this will be interesting. Meissner trying to get a little payback oh, here oh. in this bronze medal match where Boston oh. starts off with a nine. Each archer shooting three arrows. And there's a nine. Per end. Okay. Both low left again. So we're seeing off the practice field. They'll shoot a total of 15 arrows, okay. five ends. Each low. Nine points. Exactly. And that'll count as a nine as well. Nine points, tied score. Okay. So we're still tied. Janine Meissner shooting in her first outdoor World Cup event at this level. And the first shot we've seen in that six ring. So an excellent opportunity right now for Janine Meissner to forge ahead, take the lead after the first end, which she does with a nine. So it's a three point lead for Janine Meissner. Yeah, you can see the young Turk was very happy with that last shot, but that might be some nerves slipping in there. So 27 points for Janine. As she fires up three straight nines, two nines, and then that six. What is she most on? And she quickly falls behind in this match by three points, but. Still have plenty of opportunity to try to catch up. Now, what's at stake here today in the individual competition? Well, if you take this match and win the bronze medal, you pick up 18 points. If you do not win this match, you still get 15 World Cup points. So you may not get the medal, but still, somebody, each of these archers will come away with some very important World Cup points. Absolutely. 27-24 is where it stands as we start the second end. Bravo. And Yashin, back in the nine ring. She's unranked, competing in her first World Cup event and her first international event of any kind at any level. Okay. Hala, devam. Sakin. Eight. Good, good. 
I'm soaking a bit. And I think that expression as she released the shot told the story. Yeah, she's just shooting them a little bit soft. So as it's about to go off, you can see her elbow just coming forward, which is making them go to the left. Nine. Okay. Hadi yeşim. Right now, that's five straight nines for Janine Meissner. Nine. And a solid end for Yushin Bostan. Do you think that bubble hat there is necessary in Antalya? I think it's starting to warm so. up. <laughs> It's obviously working. So, um, Got to deal with the uh, elements here in Antalya, Turkey. Of course, have to do that everywhere. You go and compete and shoot, but especially with this sunshine. Brilliant sunshine. An excellent shooting right now for Germany's Janine Meissner. Who has herself a four-point lead now, 54 to 50, picking up another point. As all of her six shots have wound up in the nine ring. The big difference in this match right now, that's six on the third shot of the first end for Yashin Bostan. Put her in a bit of a hole right now and trying to dig her way back out of it, trailing by four with three more ends to go. Now at stage one in Shanghai, it was Alejandro Usquiano defeating Afsane Shafi of Iran to win the bronze medal there. And then in Medellin, Inga Van Kaspel defeated Albina Laganova by one point. In the driving rain, as I recall. That's right. Far cry from the conditions we have here in Antalya. Meisner, a direct hit. And a big shot that delights the crowd here on Coney Alti Beach. Nine on the line. And now an opportunity. Probably an eight, yeah. Bostan, can she capitalize? Yes. A little bit. Could have been better, but. So you think, you think a six is a horrific shot, but you only need two eights to equal it. So she's still in the game. See how Meisner responds. Responds with a nine. So that four point lead may be down to three. We'll have to wait and see. It's a three-point difference in favor of Janine And it is important to stay hydrated. Yeah, it is. I'm not quite sure what she was drinking in there, but uh, it certainly wasn't water, but... Well, she's got the banana for the potassium. Yeah, very good. And not sure what the a magic elixir is in the bottle, but <laughs> whatever it is, it seems to be working right now for Janine Meisner of Germany, the 19-year-old who's going for the bronze medal here. See that bubble hat? That's what you need in these conditions. It's keeping that site <laughs> nice and warm. Absolutely. I was worried about that. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah, don't want it to get too cold. No, no, no. The Turkish flag flying high. As Yashim Boston. Maybe sitting three shots back now. 81 points for Janine Meissner. She's looking relaxed. She's looking focused. She's quite comfortable on the field there. She took a three-point lead in the first end, bumped it up to four after six arrows, and now after nine arrows, leads by three. 81-78. Advantage Meissner. Six arrows to go. Down by three, Yashim Bostan. On the Turkish mixed team, which came in ninth here in Antalya. Six points. This past week, and that will not help. 
Parkman Gusto. To say the very least, especially after Meisner follows up with a 10. Yeah, you can see the difference in reactions to these two. So the Turk is, I would think she's punching the shot because you see the reaction isn't balanced. You can't see her elbow flowing back nicely. She's got a uh, thumb trigger on there and I would think she's probably deciding to shoot now. The German here, I think she's a back tension. Look at how dynamic this release is. Nine. Both together, nice balance yeah, shot. Yeah, sure. It's a much better way, much more consistent way under pressure to shoot. So they're working for Janine Meisner. And that is very close to the line. Probably an eight, but I'm not sure. From that angle, tough to tell. Nine. And Meisner just consistently okay. moving forward. Right now bear in mind, as Nikki Hun mentioned moments ago, and I think that's a good idea, the potassium from the banana, keep you strong. I think yeah. it's, uh, especially on a warm weather day like this, out in the sunshine. Meisner losing to Boston 144 to 139 at the European Youth Championships just a few weeks ago. Do you think she's after revenge? Could be. Might be in the back of her mind, I would suppose. <laughs> no, archers don't think about things like that, do they? No. no. Just you and the target. You and the target. That's yep. it. Focus. It's Stay focused. <laughs> it's all about those rings down there. <laughs> So the lead has now grown to six, 109, 103. Obviously that's six, but Yashim Bostan, her second six of the match, by the way, and a couple of those in one match, pretty tough to overcome. Yeah, you know, it's at this level, World Cup level, uh, it's pretty tough, but it's a high pressure event here. It's her first big international at this, the home crowd cheering for her, so it's a great experience. Trailing by six, Boston with three more shots to go. Back in the nine ring. Meisner won better. Should Lead is up to seven. All our arrow holes there in the low low left. Just maybe sight over and more tens. Ten Beautiful better. shot. Right down Broadway. Ten <laughs> it's always interesting when somebody shoots a shot like that, yeah. then the next arrow. Yeah. Right on the spider. She's right on the spider. Probably unaware of what her opponent scored or where she hit, but came right back. And oh. nine to finish. Just outside the line. That's a good finish. I think she'll go away fairly happy with that last end. A three to win it, and I think that's more than three. More than enough. An excellent performance by Janine Meissner of Germany, who lost to Yashim Bostan back in May, but gets her revenge here today in Antalya on Kunialti Beach as Janine Meissner of Germany accepts congratulations from Yashim Bostan. And as you said, great experience. There's no way to duplicate this anywhere else. You have to get here and participate in something like this, Nikki, to actually understand what this is like. That's right. I mean, we run lots of simulations. We try and get in the same sort of mental place as you would do at a big competition. But I think until you're out there on that carpet with the, all the cameras in place, a whole team of people working behind the scenes and everything else going on, you can't really create it that, that well. So there you see the final score is a seven point win, 138 to 131 the final score. In favor.